Complete guide to export WordPress posts to CSV or XML files. Hi, I'm Emily from ITM Lanco. In today's video, I guide you through exporting WordPress posts, whether you need to back up your content, transfer it to another site, or bulk edit post data. We've got you covered. Let's start with why export WordPress posts from WordPress. You might want to save blog posts to your computer, transfer posts to another WordPress site, or bulk edit data using CSV files. Now, let's get into the how to export WordPress posts to CSV or XML files. There are a few reliable methods to export posts. The first, WordPress default export tool. The next one is SQL query for advanced exports. And the last one is WordPress bulk edit plugin. Let's review these methods one by one. Method one, export post to XML file by WordPress default. The simplest and the most standard way to export post to XML file is to use the export tool in WordPress. For this purpose, just go to the tools and select export. On the export page, enable the post options. Then choose one of the options to export post details to an XML file. Export post from a specific categories. The first option in exporting post details is categories. This is useful when you want to export some posts which are published in a specific category. When you open the combo box of categories, you can see a list of all categories and you can choose one of them to export the post related to it. Export post by other. Another option for export post is others, which enables you to filter posts published by one of the others and export post details. Export post by date. By choosing one of the months listed in the start date and date end fields, the posts in the specific range are exported. Export a list of all posts by status. If you want to filter posts based on their status, like published or scheduled, and export them, this field is helpful. Now click on the download export file button. Then you can see XML file downloaded and saved in your system. As you may notice, there are some limitations in WordPress default export tool. Please keep watching, I'll cover some limitations and explore powerful solutions to give you more control over your exports. Method 2. Use SQL query to export posts. If you have access to your database management system and you know how to run SQL queries, this method can work for you. But before starting this method, please back up your database to use it in case of any problem after running the query. Open phmyadmin and use the SQL query and the mentioned article in the description. In the next method, you will get to know the WordPress post bug edit plugin with a lot of amazing features for filtering the exact posts that you need to export from your website. But first, would be great if you could subscribe and like your video. Method 3. Export post details to CSV or XML file by WordPress post bug edit plugin. This plugin helps you to export posts with flexible filtering options and an easy to use interface. Stay with me to introduce you to this powerful and user friendly plugin. Step 1. Download and install WordPress post or page bulk edit plugin. The first step for using this awesome plugin is download and install it on your website. You can get this plugin via the direct URL in the description. After activating this plugin, you can see the item land menu and WP post in the WordPress dashboard. Step 2. Export WordPress posts. In the main toolbar, there are different tools available for filtering, bulk editing, and exporting posts. To use these tools for export posts, click on the filter icon to filter the post you want to export. Mark the post you need to export in the table. Click on the Import Export button to see the related form. In the Import Export form, you can set one of the options to export posts. First option, all posts in the table which means all posts that are shown in the table after applying the filter are exported and unselected posts means just the posts that you have marked in the table are exported. All fields means all fields and meta fields of the filtered posts are exported and only visible fields means just the fields that are marked to be displayed in the table columns are exported. There are also an option for choosing the export file type you can choose either CSV or XML file from the list. 
Finally, by clicking on the Export Now button, the exported data are downloaded as a CSV or XML file to your computer. Now, let's make some examples. Example 1. Export post by short description to CSV. Suppose you want to export posts that have a specific word in their short description. First, you have to open the filter form and go to the general tab. Then, find the post excerpt field and choose like operators from the first combo box. Now, write the word that you want. Then, go to the date and type tab. Find the post status field and choose published from the list. And now, press the get post button. Mark some of the posts if you want to export selected posts and open the import export form and select only selected posts and only visible fields. Now finally click on export. Example 2. Export posts of specific categories. First of all, you should filter by category for that. Open the filter form and go to the Categories Tag Taxonomies tab. Now, find the categories field and choose some of them, whatever you want. Then, press the Get Post button to see the list of all posts in the table. Then, you can export them as previous example. Example 3. Export Custom Post Type To export a custom post type, you can select your desired custom type. Now, you can export all or selected posts from the table by using Import Export as I explained before. For example, let's select page. Now the plugin will show a list of all pages in the table. So to export some of the pages, select some rows in the table. Now open import export form. Then choose only selected post and all fields. And finally press the export now button. If you open the downloaded CSV file, you can see all the information about the selected pages. Example 3. Export posts with images. To export posts with images, you need to add the thumbnail column to the table. To add or remove any columns in the post table, you can use the column profile tool. By clicking on this tool, the column profile form is opened and you can mark the thumbnail column. After pressing the apply to table button, you can see the post image in the table. Now, you can easily mark the post you want to export in the table. Then, open the import export form and use it to export the selected posts. When WordPress export posts with images, you can see a thumbnail column in the CSV file. Well, as you can see, the first two methods have their limitations and issues. The best way to handle exporting posts from WordPress is by using or WordPress Postbot Edit plugin. With our plugin, you'll enjoy flexible filtering options allowing you to export exactly what you need without hassle. Thanks for watching! If you find this video helpful, please like, comment, and subscribe for more WordPress tips and guides. See you in the next video!